I fight, not simply with my opponent. I fight with my demons of doubt, with my exhaustion, with my past failures, with my injuries, with that unrelenting voice that tells me to stop. But I'm a fighter, and one thing is certain, I will be victorious. starts getting up, starts grabbing my back. What I want to do is kind of post and start running that way. So ideally, I would love to be able to step over the top of him, okay? But I don't always often have a chance. So I'm going to start backing up and backing and backing and circling until I can get to this side. Okay? That's the first one. Number two, he has me here. He has my back and I'm not able to like roll over my shoulder. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create some space between his hip and my leg and I'm going to roll over my opposite shoulder. So I'm going to stick my head and the forearm in that little hole that I just made here. So I'm going to swim this way over the other shoulder and now I can come on top. So even though he has my back, it won't prevent me from rolling. Okay. So one more time with that one. He has my back. I create some space. I'm going to roll over my far shoulder and twist kind of spiral corkscrew out of there. The last one, okay? In this case, he has me pretty solid, okay? What I wanna do in this case is I'm gonna straighten the leg that's close to him, back here, completely straight. 
the other leg. I'm gonna put under his hip. Now I need to keep my body straight and tall and pull him over my legs, okay? So I'm gonna pull him this way, not on top of my chest. Once I get him started, I'm gonna use this knee to push, keep going and throw him over and now I can get to the top, okay? So one more time, it looks a little like this. We'll go a little faster, okay? Same thing, this leg straight, this leg wedges and I'm gonna go fast and that way. All right, guys, hope you enjoy. Uh, when someone's talking to you and you give them eye contact and Very good. talk to them back and actually store what they're saying in your brain and not discard it later. Yes. One of the things that we as humans have an issue with, guys, is when somebody is talking, we have this problem of wanting to talk, right? We're like waiting for our turn. Right, we're, we're not really listening. We're just waiting for them to stop talking so we can talk, right? You guys find yourself have that sometimes, yeah. right? So, so that's a skill that takes some practice, right? But we should all try to do that instead of waiting for them to be done just so I can interject and say what I wanna say, right? Actually listen and receive what they have. You having fun? Yeah, I had right. a great time. Okay. It's Here. awesome. Yeah, I didn't know anyone when I was out here. When I found you guys, it's really, Something to look forward to every day. I've just been working and enjoying the view out in Colorado. Yeah. But doing this is really giving me more purpose. You know? Awesome, man. I'm glad to hear. Uh, for me, the, the vibe here um, is it's a, it's a good vibe when you come in. You don't feel like you're going to get hurt. Uh, you know, it comes from you, Professor. You kind of set the tone. Uh, the facility is super clean, and uh, it's just a great place to be. People come in here, you know, when they're passing by, um, and they're not even rolling that day. So it's just a fun place to be. One thing that you said to me that might be a cliche is that, hey, the guy you are today can beat the guy you were that start, the, the day you came in. Oh, yeah. What do you think about that? That rang true. Yeah. That rang true. And I heard it. And then it became, hey, the guy this month can beat the guy I was last month. Absolutely. And so it just keeps me wanting to come all the time. So yeah. that's why I enjoy it. And I've taken that and I've turn that into the guy I am outside. Absolutely. To say that yeah. I'm better, I want to be better than the guy I was yesterday. Very good. And so I've tied that to everything. Oh, that's beautiful. Healthier, I feel better. Went down to Arizona to hike with my kids. It was supposed to be a three mile hike. Turned into 11. And uh, I couldn't have done that before. So uh, I'm, this is helping me out. I'm getting healthier and stronger. Awesome. And